Friday to brand their exclusives. So when this came out, wait, let me go to the article real quick. Don't know why it's taking its time to load now. It's because you didn't pay for the premium membership. Ah, uh, makes sense. I just paid for my internet. That's not exactly. Enough. It's kind of crazy still. Don't know why they do this to me. So uh, <laughs> Sony unveils their PlayStation um, Studios new look with a new flashy intro. Which looks a lot like the Marvel logo. See, yeah. <laughs> it's a bit mad. The opening animation of PlayStation Studios features its Sony characters. You've got Nathan Drake from Uncharted. You've got Aloy from Horizon Zero Dawn. You've got Kratos from God of War. Ratchet and Clank from... Ratchet and Clank. There you go. And they reflect upon the three versions of the triangle, circle, cross, square icons. Um, where's this guy? Le- Lapel. He explained that we were thinking about how to unite all our great uh, games underneath one brand. And really, uh, the purpose of this is to help the consumers understand that. And with this branding, being it robust, innovative, this deep experience to come to expect from PlayStation. So my question to you is, since obviously no PlayStation 5 is coming, do we really need like a new brand logo in or some kind of new like thing to showcase Yes, if you see this logo, you're getting a place with an exclusive. Rotted. Because <laughs> <laughs> like, for me, like these titles have been doing well. You don't like it? Not that I don't like it. I just think like people have been doing this before. So I don't know if they're doing it because the PlayStation 5 is around the corner and they're just trying to just be like, here's a controller, here's a new studio house. Here's this, here's that, where I'm like, Sony, like, you've always been this person to just do you. So I'm not saying don't ever follow suit, but... How, s- how do you see this as following suit? Like, I think Xbox has already done theirs time ago where they had, like, a flashy intro, like, all their things were glowing. You see um, the, the chief, Master Chief, you see this person, that person is like... I think, is it, I think they must be, might be called Xbox Studios as well. Mm. So I'm like, we've always had um, Sony Interactive, what's the title? Sony Interactive something. As soon as we see that, we know it's up. But then they're saying this is for the consumer, but the titles have always sold well. So See, but when they say it's for the consumer, for me, I'm thinking about Xbox players when they see this. Right. So let's say you're an Xboxer Mm. and you see this new logo. Mm. All you're seeing is everything you can't play. And all you're seeing is all of the characters you want to play with. Right. All of the characters in every trailer, all of the characters in any place you go, you hear that these stories are the best. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, to me, is what that looks like. That's mm. not for me and you, bro. Because okay, cool. we're already in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're already playing as Nathan Drake, Aloy, Kratos. We're, that's, it's for everyone else who's not. Mm. It's for saying... Oh, you know that person you saw on that bus that one time? Uh, you know that game with that little kid with the bow and arrow and his dad's mad, yeah? <laughs> yeah? Wherever you saw that, it's saying that, look, this is where they live together. Mm. Are you part of this? It's not for me and you, bro. Mm-hmm. It's for everyone else. So when I see it, I'm like, yeah, bro, that's gangster, fam. My real question from that is, are we getting another Uncharted game with Nathan Drake? I would, I've been saying this for time. I don't think it's Nathan Drake anymore, but the Uncharted name itself will live on through maybe her daughter, maybe Chloe, maybe Nadine. Why put Nathan in a thing then? Because he's Nathan. Yeah. So obviously we... Spoilers, by the way. So three, two, one. At the end of number four, you see old man Nathan. But he's not dead. He's not dead. So you, what, you're saying that maybe... Bro. But then the, the girl, the Half daughter... Of- of Uncharted 4 is a flashback. <laughs> I just say, bro, half the game's a flashback. Like, 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 what do you want me to say? I don't know. Like, don't they know. could do a story with his daughter mm. and him, be- oh. where his daughter is 25 yeah. and she's retracing a mission that Nathan did mm. at 25, mm-hmm. but we play the flashback parts as Nathan yeah. and the forward parts as her. Like, yeah. boom, naughty dog. <laughs> They thought you would. Hello? You know? They thought you would. Like, bro, it's this, this, this. Oh, I hear that, I hear like, that, I hear that. But, bro, I'm only taking that from the stuff that they've given me. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? So it's there. And even them putting Nathan on the thing, I'm like, bro, like, 
maybe we're getting another game from Nathan. Like, bro, the thing is, it's, it's mad for me because I got into Uncharted so late. Mm. But Uncharted 4 is a banger, bro. Mm. I would I'd play Uncharted 5. Get me. So, yeah, man. Okay, cool. How about it? I, like, obviously, I'm always a guy that doesn't want to retire characters anyway. So, if they're saying that this is now the house for all these names, then I would hope eventually in PlayStation 5 going forward, we do, like you're saying, see Uncharted, the next chapter. Obviously, we're getting God of War, God knows when, but that's going to be playing being number two. But even that's a matter within itself. That's why, that, that, that's why I'm thinking that Uncharted will do another game. Because, bro, look at the screen. When the screen come up, it's got Nathan, and he's first. Yeah. He's first. <laughs> then yep. it's Aloy. You know you know, um, Horizon 2 is coming out with PS5. Mm. You know God of War is coming with another game. Mm. So why is that, bro? Did they have, no, they had um, uh, Ellie in it, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, bro, I just... No, think, I've got fingers <laughs> crossed for her. Lunch. The thing is, if I never get it, I wouldn't be disappointed. Mm. But if I did get it, I'd be excited. So, wait, I don't see why you wouldn't. Oh, hell with that. Hell Bring with it that. back. Give it to another studio. But I know Naughty Dog doesn't want to do something like that. But you know what I'm saying? Do what to another studio? Like, I'm tried. To another studio? To do it. Like, bruv, this done, bruv. Arkham Knight it, fam. You know? Oh, so you mean like, a, a, like a, another branch of yeah, Naughty Dog? Yeah, another branch of Naughty Dog. You, man, just... You ten people work on the next one. Mm. Get to me. Man, that's kind of mad still. Um, and even with the movie coming out, with the movie coming out, bruv, you've got to do another game. That's it. You have to. So a tie-in? No, it's just... not a tie-in. Oh, okay, we don't. There's no. We don't do tie-ins no more. But mm. it's still good to. Oh, new movies coming out. Here's a game mm. to remember. Like, imagine by the time they get this movie out, like, what two, three years from now, would be what six, seven years removed from the last Uncharted game. Right. I don't know. Is it, dog... even, is it even going to be in anyone's mind anymore? <laughs> Probably not. Exactly. Well, no, though, they take... Well, how long did the last of... Like, last of Us took, like, seven years since the last one. So... I don't know, like... That means time's good. We're right on cue, Ooh, almost. Now, all right, this guy's... Boy, I I'm just... I'm just... Bro, what are Naughty Dog doing after uh, uh, Last of Us 2? I wish I knew. We don't know. <laughs> I wish we I knew. We don't know. I wish I knew. Right, okay, cool. All right, I hear that. So it's not for us then. Guys, let us know in the Super Chats, what do you think of the PlayStation Studios logo? Is it going to bring more to the studios? Are you expecting a lot more? You're not expecting anything at all? You're like, why is this even a thing? Let us know. Let I think, I think it's a good idea, but I think they should have made the logo less like Marvel's logo. Yeah, like... I thought that was mean? weird. Because mm. it's not even, like, subtle. Like, yeah, that's exactly the same as a Marvel logo. Yeah, like the name and everything, like... That's what I mean. Why don't you just keep it Sony Interactive? I don't know. But you know what? One thing I do rate Sony for is keeping the, the original... You know that PS? Oh, that's... Yeah, that can't be. I hope that never changes ever. I love that, bro. Yeah. I love that. I love that. I love that. I even went... I think... I want to go see, like, a, a picture of... I think I was trying to get a picture of the, the Sony logo. And they showed you how they went through the stages of how they got to it. And it was, like, 20 pictures of... Maybe it's supposed both be flat. Maybe wants to be, like... Like, uh, what do you call it? 3D. wants to be flat. I'm like... They must have took them time before they just became that concept. That, that thing's pattern, and I love that. You know when they released the PS5 text, mm. and it's the exact the same as the PS4, but yeah. with a 5? Yeah. I also love that as well, because I don't feel like... You don't need to, like, do something crazy every time. Like, bro, mm. just change the number. Yeah, boom, we're good. Yeah. Like but I think like it's her. weird the way they release it. Like, they're like, the press conference, here's the PS5. Bro, you change one text, bro. <laughs> Like, don't do the press conference thing, but just... Keep... Oh, for the whole thing. Yeah, but just bring, it, yeah, bring them all out together. Yeah. Like, all right, look, here's the PS5 logo, here's the controller. Mm. And then you release the console later. Okay, cool. But I'm glad we've seen the controller, isn't it? The dual, the dual sense. Okay. Someone keeps complaining. It's like, oh, yeah, you're, you're doing this, but when are we going to see this? So I don't know how... Everyone's going to complain. If they dropped it all on one day, someone's going to... Well, well, yeah... Got all this information on one day is too much. <laughs> like, bro, shut up, fam. People are gonna complain regardless, yeah, fam. People will complain regardless. Smile, though. You can't win. You can't win. But I, I just want to see more from these studios. Like, if if they're doing this now and encompassing all these stuff that we've seen from the last couple of years, obviously, I don't think there there is a new studio, so to speak. But I want to see more from these titles that they're saying that this is their studio. You know, I want to see more games to be honest, from these bigger studios. 
Damn. And I feel like maybe I'm putting too much pressure. But, bro, like, <clears throat> I'm getting it one game every six years, bro. Be a bigger studio. Make two games. I'm just, bro, what? I don't know. Movie studios are pumping these movies out. They've got divisions everywhere. Like, the gaming, like, we need to do more. <laughs> do more in the gaming industry. We need industry. to do more. We need more games. More games. I don't know, man. Crunch time is a thing, in it? So, bro, I'm not saying crunch people. That's the- I'm saying, <laughs> what did I first thing I said? Make the studios bigger. bigger hire yeah. more people. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? Maybe this is what this is for, isn't it? Maybe we're gonna get more studios on PlayStation. Right. Oh, that's the thing, guys. Let us know in the super chats if you got anything. I'm about to read any. If not, we're about to move on to the next somebody check. PlayStation need to grab Criterion out of that limbo they're in. And I feel they're from them, yeah, man. I know them. Man. 